So there's a multitude of different things you can put on your line using this twitching technique. Here's a few that we have here. Uh, we have different flies, hoochies, and twitching jigs. So all multitude of different colors. It's good to have all different colors in your box because something's always gonna work better than the other. Salmon seem to be very finicky on color at times. Um, these hoochies are definitely something that's overlooked a lot. People see them at the store, people walk right past them, but coho love hoochies. And the way I have this one set up is a little bit unique. You can either put these right on the end of a jig head. If you just get a bare half ounce jig head, you could stick the hoochie on the end. But the way I like to fish it, something Cameron showed me, is with these bullet weights. And what you do is you cut a little hole in the top of the hoochie, you slide that over your line, you get these bullet weights. This is a 3 8 I might even go a little heavier with these hoochies. And that's just the bullet weight with the hole in it, so it slides right over your line. And then I tie a 2 aught hook onto it with an egg loop right on the bottom there. So this is a fun way to fish these hoochies. Again, you can fish them different ways as well. You can put them right on a jig. And then laying next to this here is what we call Dalai Lamas. These are a, a, a fly, but work really well on a spinning rod in some situations. You guys have seen them fished in Alaska and fished on a few other of our films. But what I like to do with these is I like to put these right on the line, tie these flies right to your, your braided line and or your, your bumper that you have here, and then add split shots above it. Usually I'll put two to three number seven split shots right on the line above that fly and just crimp them down. And these fish very well, just like a twitching jig. Uh, casting out, letting it float down river and working it up and down in front of those fish's faces. So the difference between these three presentations is how they act in the water. With a 3 8 or a half ounce jig here, like you see on the bottom, this jig is gonna go up and down very rapidly in the water column. And as it does that, it'll induce a different kind of bite. Now when you have these hoochies and or you have these flies, it's a much more delicate presentation. You don't have to be quite as violent with your twitching motion because of the weight of the fly and or the hoochie. Because it's not a half ounce or three eighth ounce heavy, you don't need to pull as hard with the tension against your line and current to make that fly move. So that's the main difference and that's why it's key to have all three because at some point in time, the fish aren't gonna want something going straight up and down. They're gonna want something more at a fluttering presentation that's moving past them sporadically, not such a straight up and down presentation. So that is the main difference between all three of these different uh, coho presentations is mainly the way that it goes in front of the fish and the way it flutters in front of them and the way it falls. So twitching jigs, hoochies, and flies. Go to the river with all of them. <laughs>